everybody, I'm Manny. Welcome back to my channel, So Cal Shave. So we're gonna get into a different, um, a different month uh, of shaving here. So I'm gonna call this uh, the month of Grey Dog. So Grey Dog, if you're watching, buddy, this one's for you. This whole month is for you. So I'm gonna go through all my Grey Dog brushes. Finally, I've been waiting and dying to get to these brushes. It's been a long time, long time overdue. Uh, and it's just, I have so many things in the den at the moment that I'm trying new products, excuse me, trying new products, uh, uh, software, hardware, you know, anything from brushes to soap, some from blades to uh, new razors. And it's just been a plethora of different stuff come through the den here. And it's just been out of control. So I'm pretty stoked to finally get into uh, these brushes and really get really get a chance to break in and enjoy uh, the uh, horse hair that he sent over here that I have on the side. It is currently blooming in some hot water here, and also need to break in that custom synthetic that I he had made for me. Uh, so great dog, buddy. I hope you enjoy this full month. It's this one for you, buddy. So let's get into the shave here now. I had talked to Alex uh, that I am thinking of doing um, probably a mixture of oud and sandalwood for the month. Don't know exactly if that's what I want to do. You'll, you'll, hold, you'll go ahead and see what I'm planned here, what I, ha what I have planned here for... Um, I kind of wanted to do either a sandalwood and an oud uh, for the month of uh, May or also uh, in general, uh, anything that was uh, characteristics of a brown theme, uh, color, whether it be a brownish aftershave or a brownish label. But anyways, let's get into it here. And we'll just go with the flow and see how things go. But uh, I've been really dying to get into this sandalwood here, Sangre de Drago, from Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements or Phoenix Shaving. And there is a side label there. And here are the ingredients on the side, if you'd like to see that there. And yeah, this is just one of my favorite sandalwood scents. It's just a beautiful scent, guys. Beautiful, beautiful scent. The color on that is a, a brownish tinge to it. Uh, beige, I guess you would say. It is a beautiful, beautiful scent if you guys are into sandalwood. I know a lot of guys aren't into sandalwood because they always... They always um, think about uh, uh, earthy or dirty, um, but no, there's different types of sandalwood out there. There's a lot of mixture of sandalwoods mixed with ouds and stuff like that that just make and branch out the scents, you know, especially when they got like lavender in it, you know, um, a mixture of uh, different types of oud. I mean, there's many different types of uh, oud, you know, Indian oud and uh, so on and so forth. You know, there's just so many different types of uh, scents out there, guys. So we'll be getting into that there. The razor for the shave here will be my Black Beauty. Um, and I will post up the date code on there because I don't know. It's hard to see because of this lighting. Sometimes you can't see it. Uh, let me see without bumping the camera. Yeah, you definitely cannot see that. And it is a um, a P3. Let's see if I try not to bump the camera there. Yeah, you can't see that. There's a P on the side. Anyways, it's a P3. Um, and are we matching it up with the aftershave there and if you guys can see all the reminiscence of the ingredients down at the bottom there I don't know if you guys can see that very well you guys can see that and it does say shake well this is one of the aftershaves I got at Old Town Shaving so if you guys can see that down there so you do have to shake this up which is I shake up which is, which is the reason why I shake up all my uh, aftershaves and here we are with the gray dog the gray dog horse and i just uh now woke up not too long ago gotta get some stuff ready because i'll be heading out tonight sadly i'll be doing uh solo loads from here on out so i will no longer be teaming up as a team uh as a team driver with my brother anymore uh there is some stuff that's happened in um just this a uh, few couple of days 
unfortunate events um, that you know we weren't expecting. So that is what it is, and there's nothing we can do about that but to just embrace it and go with the flow. And our blade here will be the Derby Premiums. And this has two shaves on it. So we'll see how we get into that one. I haven't used that in quite some time, so I don't know if the blade will be any good anymore. Um, we'll have to check that out right now. And let me go ahead and load my blade. Load my razor, excuse me. Give me a second. Let me check this blade out. All right. Looks pretty good. And there you are. Derby Premium. Set it down. And uh, don't know if I used a premium in this one before. So let's do it on setting four. Clamp it down with that fi final last quarter turn. There is a setting four there on that dot. Set that off to the side. And let's get to lathering this soap so how have you guys been doing um i hope you guys have had a great one don't want to make a mess over here yeah as like i said on my end it's uh it's been okay i'm just letting all this suds fall down into the sink don't really need those Yeah, my my uh, my day's been all right. I uh, have a few videos that I've posted up. If you guys haven't had a chance to see those, go check those out. But I'm making the best of what I can. You know, it is what it is. You know what I mean? You gotta roll with the punches sometimes, guys. We'll go with that and see how that goes. I'm not too very familiar with this uh, brush yet, like I like it to be. And I just did a hot tail to the face. Just cleaning off the puck. Yeah, so I've been really dying to get into this, um, these uh, brushes, especially this horse one, because uh, I really want to get the experience with it. Let me rinse off my puck. Start to dry. <clears throat> I hope you guys have been having some fantastic shaves. I'm really happy that I've got a chance to do that full month with that sterling. Because, man, I learned so much from that brush. Patience and how things pay off. And just a satisfactory of when it, when it pays off. Now some water.
beautiful brush. So soft, beautiful scent. Warm up my razor. Let's get to it. And I think I have, um, Uh, 24 hours worth of growth, maybe a little bit more. I lose track of that, guys. Forgive me. I haven't shaved. The last time I shaved was with the Ingram, so whatever amount of days that is. First pass down. Bring this down. 
setting three. There you are, cross grain. Mm some more soap. the first time. Let's see what this passed. Let's see if we keep it on a setting three.
Nope, let's bring it down to setting two. Something doesn't seem right about this, right now about this blade. Let me put it to setting nine. This blade feels really chattery. Give me a second, guys. Let me. Where's this blade at? Let me put in the the thins. Bring it back down. Setting four. Hmm. Nope, something's not right here, guys. I'm not just feeling this this razor day. I'm gonna bring it back down. Let me put it on setting one, which is kind of odd. Hmm, much smoother. Okay, let me take that blade back out and put the Derby Premium back in. Let's see if this changes things. Guys, sorry man, I am struggling today.
Mm. Wow. What I'm doing right now is just trying to clean up what was supposed to be the third pass. Yeah, I'll do this. That normally doesn't happen, guys. Let me put some stick tick on that. The month of Grape Dog turned out to be, uh, guy jinxed me. Supposed to be your month there, uh, Grape Dog? Why are you doing like that, man? Anyhow. See if we can get some clean ups.
All right, guys, I'm gonna rinse off with uh, warm water, cold water. Um, yeah, and I'm gonna do the uh, alum on camera. All right, guys, I just rinsed off. Warm water, cold water. I'm gonna go into alum stick and this is going to sting. A little stingy and actually not as bad as I thought it was going to be. A little down here. Just under this area right here. A little up here. Definitely on the lip. Nothing up this way. A little right here. That's about it. All right, let me uh, rinse this. Let me rinse this alum off and I'll be back for the rest of the post. All right, guys, I'm back. Let's get into the matching aftershave and you'll see all that stuff. See how everything bounces up there. So you gotta shake it really well. Now the shave um, went pretty well. I just don't know what the heck happened with that blade. It doesn't feel um, a little next here, but I don't feel any irritation that I could feel. Um, let me get a nice dose of that. Pour it out the back. Yeah, what I think it might be, one, because I haven't used that dirty blade in a long time, it may have went bad. Um, it's been a long time. Um, and two, maybe that uh, Super Thin can only you do two or three shades on it, so maybe I went in with two bad blades. <laughs> um, not much stinging from the alcohol. Uh, up here, down here, a little bit down here, um, but it doesn't feel like I got any irritation, so that's a plus. We'll see how it goes. Anyways, <clears throat> sorry about that, guys. It might be a long video. Recap, Sangre de Drago from Phoenix Artists and Accoutrements, PAA. And um, I already rinsed off my puck setting it to dry off to the side went in with my gray dog horse brush beautiful brush love it it's just the knot didn't get all knotted up so that's a plus didn't have any issues at all beautiful went in with the matching aftershave splash Went in with our um, Gillette Black Beauty. And uh, what did we do? Setting, setting four, and then setting three, and then two, and then six, and nine, and 12, and 15. And I don't know what else we did with that one, but uh, I tried to make it work. It did at the very end, but uh, that was some, uh, a little bit of casualties on my face there. Uh, what else? What am I missing? Is that everything? One, two, three, four, five. I don't think I'm missing anything. Oh, yes, I am. We went with the Derby Premiums, guys. So that's my shave, guys. Sorry it didn't go as I planned. Great dog, you're a jinxer. Um, so thank you very much for that one. Not a great way to start the month of May or to start the month of Grey Dog. Uh, so it is what it is, guys. I mean, um, 
we can't always get the best shaves. I put up whatever shaves I get, whether they're good or bad. If I get nicks or I get cut, it's gonna come up. So you've seen whatever I put up there. My shaves are pretty, you know, pretty, uh, fairly well. I mean, they're not the best, but I get great shaves. And, um, yeah, fortunately, this one didn't go according to plan. So that, that's what you guys get, you guys. So uh, it is what it is. So I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys like what you see, please like, favorite, share, and subscribe down below. Don't forget to hit that little bell icon down at the bottom so that way you get my next future notifications whenever my new videos pop up. So that way you guys don't miss out. And thanks for joining me, guys. Y'all stay safe out there. Great dog. Hope you enjoyed it, buddy. Later.